It is a complaint we hear just about every day. A property owner has not mowed in months and the neglected yard is a neighborhood eyesore. Often the city will step in and take action, but Mike McKnight tells us how an inspector showed heart when learning that one homeowner is struggling to do the right thing. A code violation notice cut deep into her pride, so Joyce Albright uses the sharpest tools she has to slowly comply with the city's mow order. Do a little bit at a time. Recently, a neighbor mowed part of her front yard, but the rest of the property is overgrown, though not out of intentional neglect. Yeah, I gotta sit down. Joyce and her daughter do have a lawnmower, but it sits locked underneath the stairs. That's because a couple of months ago, it started squirting gas. They're afraid to use it. Believing she needs to pay a fine, Joyce sent the city $35, the cost of an appeal fee. I'm going to give this back to you. But City Inspector Beth Osborne returns the money order and gives Joyce more time to cut the weeds. You were very sincere in trying to send in that $35. I know that you cared and you didn't. You want to be in compliance and be a good neighbor. You're Thank welcome. you. All right. Joyce says she's glad for more time and that the city returned her appeal fee. Put it back in the bank to pay the house insurance I couldn't pay this month. Her mentally challenged daughter provides encouragement, but can't really help maintain the yard. That's what you've been using? Yeah. So Joyce will do her best to get the weeds cut because she wants to be a code-abiding citizen. Well, Mike McKnight, WWT6 News. Oh, how, how frustrating, how hard for her to keep up, but so nice yeah. that she was, you know, complying with what the city said. Just so. nobody saw, somebody saw this and I hope wants somebody to come does and, help and helps. Well, the city sends out about 7,000 letters a year ordering all those weeds to be cut. If a property owner has a hardship, then inspectors will work with them and usually extend the deadline.